Hi guys, good morning. Um, I just wanted to come on, oh gosh, that light's not great. Um, okay, sorry, I'm in my bathroom, so there's kind of a lot of glare. But anyhow, I wanted to come on, um, yesterday I had posted in my beauty group about mixing two um, different enduring lip colors, so I wanted to try that out today, and I thought I would um, do it live with you guys. So, I have already um, done my entire face. Um, the only thing I haven't done is I haven't put on um, my Perfect Press Powder, our translucent powder. So I am going to do that um, with our brush, just a large powder brush. This is our brush number two. Um, and I'm gonna drop the powder apparently. But <clears throat> yeah, here's the powder. So I'm going to just, and this powder is perfect for everyone. It literally like, I don't know, it takes years off of you. It doesn't um, give any color. It just takes away the shine, and you can't really see that because my lighting is horrible. I'll try to move over, but um, the important thing I'm gonna do with this too is I'm gonna brush it on my lips. And I've talked about this before. Um, our enduring lip colors work better when your lips um, are free of any kind of moisture or anything, so I always start with a layer of powder. So the two colors I'm gonna mix today are Sugar Plum, which is like a deep, dark, um, purpley, pinky kind of color, um, and creme brulee, which is um, like a light pink, it's a matte, they're both matte. So we're gonna start with the Sugar Plum. And again, here's the wand, it's like a, a gloss wand. You um, A little goes a long way with these. So we're gonna scrape off. Okay, now my mirror is kind of over to the side, so I'm gonna look away, but. So you can see I apply it to my bottom lip and then smack my lips. Then I'm gonna go over the top lip Almost like lining it. Okay. So this is Sugar Plum by itself. It's one of my favorites. I'm going to let that set for a second. Then we are going to go over it with Creme Brulee. So let's see what we think about this. And again, I'm going to let it sit for just a second. Um, when I'm done, I, I've actually done a decent job this time. Sometimes I mess up. Um, but if you do get outside your lips at all and you're not sure, you know, you want to fix it, concealer. Concealer with a little bit of concealer brush fixes that right up and I'll show you that when I'm done. But again, here's the creme brulee wand. Same process. We're going to scrape off, um, a lot of it because you don't. You don't need it and you don't want to waste the product. You want to keep it, right? You want to use it as much as possible. So here we go. Same, same process. Okay, I think I'm actually gonna put a little more of this on. There we go. So now, now I have kind of the color I want. Now I'm gonna go back and scrape a little more off. And just kind of use the wand to smooth out the color. So, Oh, hi, Angie. Yeah, I'm loving it, too. This is the first time I've done it. Um, <clears throat> I love that it kind of tones down the boldness of the sugar plum, but yet you still kind of have that deep, dark um, underneath layer, if that makes any sense. So this is it. This is sugar plum and creme brulee. Um, I'll take some pictures and better lighting and post them in the comments. 
Um, but this is, it's, and it's so easy. Any of our enduring lip colors, you can really mix, um, mix together like this. Um, yes, dimension. That is exactly what it adds. Um, you can mix any of our enduring lip colors together and, you know, create custom colors for whatever you like. Um, we'll have to definitely, I'm definitely going to have to try this again because I like how they're looking together. So, all right, well, I am off. Brielle has um, an appointment, so I've got to get her out of bed and we've got to get going. So everybody have a good day and I'll talk to you later. Bye.